Are you wanting to observe the solar eclipse happening soon? Then be sure that you know the safest way to protect your eyes. There's a lot of safety glasses being sold on the market now that promise you that if you buy their glasses, you can observe the sun without any damage to your eyes. Well, NASA's come out with a warning saying that a lot of them are actually bogus. If you've purchased safety glasses, you need to check that it has a certification designation of ISO 12312-2. If it doesn't have that printed on the side of them, then I wouldn't use them. And you should never just use any old sunglasses that you already have around your house, even if you double them up. It's not going to protect your eyes the way they need to be protected. Observing the celestial dance is beautiful and wonderful, but it's not worth going blind over. What if you can't afford these glasses or didn't think to buy them in time? No worries. There's a simple way to view the solar eclipse from home in total safety. All you need to do is build your own pinhole projector, and all you really need are two paper plates. Yes, with your paper plates, you can throw one down on the ground and take your second one, and you want to put a pinhole through it. Now, if you don't have a safety pin, don't just use a knife or your keys or anything like that because you really want the circle to be as perfect as possible. So what you can do is you can take something like, like a compass end or anything that's like a perfect circle and just poke through your paper plate. Then, when the solar eclipse is happening, you can take your paper plate with a hole in it and hold it above the paper plate beneath. You see, normally, everything that you can see has light bouncing off of it at you, so light is constantly bombarding us in all these directions. So with a pinhole projection like this, you're actually blocking the sun waves from hitting this plate directly, except where the hole is. Now that there's a direct light beam from the sun to your plate, you can actually see how much of the sun is being eclipsed. And if you want to be even more creative, you can repurpose one of your Amazon boxes and make a pinhole projector that you can wear on your head. All you have to do is take your normal box, turn it to the smaller face on the side, and poke your hole kind of towards the bottom of this box. So once you have your hole in there like this, you take that same size flap and put it down. You're going to leave all the other flaps up because they're going to guard the light around your eyes from entering in. Then you're going to wear the box on your head. Then just make sure that the back of your head is pointed towards the sun so that the sun can beam through the little hole and be projected onto the wall of the box in front of your eyes. So remember to keep your eyes safe this year when you're viewing the solar eclipse with either ISO 1213-12 glasses, two paper plates made into a pinhole projector, or your very own pinhole projecting box. I'm Jason Winningham, and this has been your Green Tip of the Week.